I'm on my way to class, y'all. I see my friend. No, don't be trying to hide. Hey. Like, hey. Follow him on Instagram. He's a football player. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, y'all. Today, I'm on my way to class. It is Friday. And I love Fridays. I love Fridays so much because I feel like that's the day that you rewarded for all your hard work because you're finna transition into the weekend. But I will say that Fridays and, and Mondays tend to be the most busiest days which is like it just, it just be so busy i have more work uh, i got deadlines usually most of my deadlines are on friday but you know we're gonna push through all that you know so since fridays be busy fridays really be a really productive day for me but anyway i want y'all to you know come with me today spend some time with me today y'all i actually am on my way to my statistics class and I am running late. I feel bad, y'all. I am 15 minutes late. Hey! And that's the latest that I have ever been to. Yes, I'm vlogging. Come be in my video. Look at him. He running, y'all. This my friend. <laughs> He's so funny. Where you at? Are he right now? Can you your video? Come on, yeah. I'm uh, what it is, y'all? Yeah, my name is Trey. For real. Four. <laughs> my dog, man. Yeah. Shout out to Red, follow man. Follow him on Instagram. Y'all know the vibe. Yeah, man. All yeah. that. Yeah. And shit. he got music coming out, too. Oh, yeah. Get into it, boy. Trayvon Riggins. T-R-E-V-O-N-R-I-G-G-I-N-S. Mm -hmm. There you go. Go look that shit up on YouTube. Like, yeah, boy. All right, I'll see you we'll later. See you. Oh, yeah, y'all. So we finna head to this class. That's the first step. And then we just gonna see what else awaits us in the day. Everybody about to act, this is World War VI! <laughs> like, so you see how this one has group two right here? Mm -hmm. And then group one? The, these are the equivalent of each other, so you don't have to repeat that group two is not different than group one. Wait, that's not the groups on this side, right? I thought that was the levels. Group and level, I'm using as interchangeable here. Okay, y'all, so I am done with my first class. I just, you know, wanted to stop and make sure I was looking good because next I do have a photo shoot coming up, like, in a couple minutes. I got to go meet a group of friends for a photo shoot. I'm going to tell y'all more about that, okay? But anyway, just stay tuned, y'all. I'm going to get into it, okay? Y'all, <laughs> it got chilly out of nowhere. I got a goosebumps. I'm gonna put my jacket on. <laughs> I hope y'all day is going well. Whenever you watching this. Oh, let me tell y'all about that class. While we walking over to the um where I gotta meet my friends at. Let me tell y'all about this class, this mad class. I'm gonna keep it a buck with y'all. So I don't know. I don't know what's going on, y'all. I'm gonna just be real with y'all. Two weeks ago, I was at my lowest point ever in my life. And I'm just being honest. I, and what makes it sad is that it was a lot of things that led up to that. Like, I'm just talking about school-wise. I had never been so stressed out and just so down, like, ever, you know? And let me tell y'all how bad it was. It was so bad that when I went on vacation to Miami. I had a time of my life. I was so happy. I was numb to everything that I was going through. Back at school, you know, I was, I forgot about everything. And the moment I came back to my room, the moment I got back at school and I opened the door and I, I, I smelled my room, I saw my room. I just, I just, it just reminded me mentally that I was back in school. I dropped down to the floor and I stopped bawling and crying my eyes out because I felt like I just ain't want to do it no more. Y'all killing me with this I felt like, I felt like it was it, killing me. Like, y'all trying to kill me? You killing me, man? Literally, like, I was so mad because I was trying so hard to bring my grades up. And I can't do it. Y'all just don't want to believe the truth. Up and stuff like that. And nothing was a cut in it. What more do you want from me? <laughs> you know, 
I ain't gonna put a, a big old load on y'all, you know. I don't really, and I don't really like talking about my problems either because I be feeling bad, you know. But I learned that sometimes it helps to talk because people can help you, you know. If you don't talk about it, sometimes you're just gonna suffer in silence. And that's what I did for a long time. And it's like, you know, I'm still going to classes. I'm still doing my work. But in that math class, I was lost, man. I was lost. I was like, what? Everybody was lost though. So, and I'm almost done. That's the, that's the best and the worst part. Like I felt like for so long, I ain't have enough time. I was running out of time, but damn. It is what it is, you know. I had to drop a class um, like a week ago. Like a week ago, a week ago. And if some of y'all don't know, dropping the class is when you withdraw from it and it doesn't hurt your grade. And you just drop it, it's just gone. And you're gonna have to take it again. And if I could drop all these classes, I'd drop them, I'd drop them off somewhere and never worry about them again. But I just gotta tell myself to keep going, man. And I'm just being real. I don't wanna be on my channel. And I know I be happy all the time, and I really do be happy. But when it come to college, I wanna give y'all good stuff, but also real stuff. I gotta be true within myself, you know? And I'm gonna be on this camera. I wanna give y'all that reality so that y'all, whoever watching, can be prepared. I see that a lot of people watching my channel and it's probably a lot of people that's planning on coming here. And even if you not coming to Justin State, even if you just going off to college, there's some stuff that might can help you. You know, just remember that whatever I go through, I can share it with y'all. And whatever I get through, you can get through too. You know, we'll get through it together, but it ain't no joke, man. It ain't no joke. But anyway, on the bright side, I'm headed to a photo shoot. I'm actually got, I, ca I got casted in a show on campus and we're, you know, jump starting that. We're going to get ready to start filming next week where we're doing a group photo shoot. So I'm going to head over to the horseshoe. That's where they wanted to meet at. This lighting is horrible. And I'm so sorry, y'all. Y'all deserve so much better lighting than this. Anyway, yeah, y'all. So, and I'm hungry. Come on now. I'm ready to get this over with. Dang. But anyway, yeah, y'all. <laughs> Uh, somebody taking a graduation pictures but anyway y'all this is where we finna be take y'all photo shoot at in front of the jackson state sign let me show y'all let's see jackson state university get into it yes i have this is the cast getting to it. That is the cameraman. Say, y'all need to introduce y'all What's going on? It's lovely, LC. Hey. Hey. You ain't never lie. Yay! You ain't never lie. Yes, podcast. Hey, y'all know what's going on. It's OMG. It's yes. not so on Instagram. Yes. Hold up. Get into the VV. Yes, sir. Yes. Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah, love you. Yeah, y'all didn't know. Oh, my God. Hey. What's up, Witty? You know, it's London. Yeah. Hey. 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 Okay. Y'all already know we got this, the other guy. Say hey. This is yeah. our director. Follow our um, Instagram for the reality show that will be coming out. Please underscore do. Please. With two E's, 1400. Yes. With two E's, 1400. Hey, say hey, girl. Hey, it's your girl, Caprico. You can add me on Instagram, A-C-A-P-R-Y-K-A. Right on. Yes. A-H underscore, period. Don't play with me. Don't play. Follow my business page. Don't see Ooh, yes. Hey, get it. Are you Are you careful? Follow me on Twitter, Interior 21. Hey. Interior 21. Yes, get into the camera. Man, he got my pictures <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, y'all. So now that we're done with the photo shoot, I'm gonna head over to the student center and give me something to eat because I'm so hungry. Now I'm gonna tell y'all something about me. Every Friday, I love to treat myself to Chick Fil A. I get Chick Fil A every single Friday. Okay, so that's that's really the highlight of my day too. But anyway, y'all, I don't know what I'm going to get, though. I know I always get a milkshake, but I don't know if I want nuggets or a chicken sandwich. I just want something to get me full. But, yeah. Okay. Pizza Hut. Oh, oh. This line is so long, y'all. Oh, my gosh. And I'm finna stand in it. How long y'all think it's going to take me to get my food? Long ass time, but I'm gonna wait. 
At least that gave me enough time to think about what I want. <laughs> I don't know what I want to get. And then the fries will be right here too. I want a sandwich too. So, I like that. Okay, y'all, so I made it back and I got me an AP nugget with some fries and a chicken sandwich. I'm going to save it for later because I know I'm going to be hungry later. And y'all, I was laughing because, so basically with my meal plan, my meal plan is like all you can eat, right? And they also give you $250 in Tiger, but that's where you can go um, to the student center and you can buy Chick-fil-A, you can get Subconation, you can get like all those different foods or Starbucks. You use your Tiger Bucks that's on this card. And y'all, I only got $2 left. I can't eat. I'm broke, nigga. I'm broke. <laughs> so I'm really feeling be sad, but it's okay. They let you pay with your card if you um you know run out and usually around this time everybody be tiger looks be gone but let me show y'all this little trick that i saw and it looks so good i wish you get a um salad container i really wish i could have got a bigger one and this is what you do you take your nuggets i'm gonna just pour a couple because it's not gonna be enough room in here for a couple of nuggets and i take I got all this sauce in my pocket. I'm saucing, I'm saucing, I'm saucing on you. <laughs> I got Chick-fil-A sauce and Polynesian. That's how you know it's gonna be good. I'm gonna show y'all. And then you just, you just dibble and you just add a little here. And then you add the fries on top of this. You add the fries. Ooh. You add the fries and Y'all, I'm sad. I ate like a whole lot of my fries in the line. And I'm gonna add my Chick fil A sauce on top. Let me know if y'all like this look creation. I saw it on Instagram. Yeah. And then I'm gonna add me a couple more nuggets. Dang, man, I'm dropping nuggets. Come on now. <laughs> And then, ooh, you just wanna, ooh, you better yeah, you better crazy. But anyway, y'all, I'm just gonna sit in here. I am in the study room. It's like a room where you can come in here. It's really, really quiet, really, really peaceful. I just came here to just eat in, in peace and quiet. I actually like to come here a lot. It's on the fifth floor in my residence hall. And I just be in here, you know, I just be in here. Sometimes I just need to, you know, isolate myself so that I can just, you know, just breathe and I don't, you know, but yeah, I'm finna eat y'all, I'm finna eat. Let me get a nugget. <laughs> yeah. I eat so ugly y'all, that is so embarrassing, okay, I'm gonna see y'all later. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> Basically, a hot spot is when a DJ comes and set up and plays music. You know, we dance, we have a good time. Just a few days ago, we did have a gospel hot spot, so that was really nice too.
but as of right now y'all i'm just chilling i really just wanted to come outside like get some fresh air you know being around nature i am by myself right now but in a few hours i do have to go i have to be to rehearsal by 7 p.m so that will be nice for you know i have to rehearse for a play that i am in so before then hopefully i can squeeze in and go get me some dinner because i probably won't leave rehearsal until like after dinner like around nine but anyway y'all i thank y'all for making it this far if you are here i hope you are enjoying it and just stay with me y'all the day is almost over okay y'all so i am on my way to rehearsal i had about an hour and i was just going over my lines and everything i have a lot of lines look like them um i do got some good news this is my first ever lead role inside of a play so i'm really happy about that but with that position comes a lot of responsibility i have the most lines in the play so i'm really gonna have to bring it you know a part of being an actor is really like studying studying and perfecting your craft like all these lines they don't you don't just remember it overnight so i gotta from the first act you know got this script you know just had to you know read over it and really connect with my character so i can so not only do i remember what she's saying but I also remember what's like the significance behind what she's saying you get what i'm saying but anyway i'm gonna head to this auditorium i really like i, I think personally what i'm gonna do when i start walking there it's really just start warming up because I talk really fast as it is and you know I really have to learn how to slow it down and also learn how to really like really just be careful with my words like this is one of the warmers we be having to do it go like this it's so funny y'all 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 try and say it too I won't try to say it if y'all do that's gonna be so funny but here it go it's like this a big black bug bit a big black bear and the big black bear bled blood a big black bug bit a big black bear and the big black bear bled blood and another one is whether the weather be fair or whether the weather be not whether the weather be cold or whether the weather be hot whether the weather whatever the weather whether we like it or not so just saying those things before you get into you know reading the strip reading the strip. see y'all y'all see how fast i i talk and sometimes i mess up words you don't want to do that you really gotta i gotta slow it down but anyway y'all i'm gonna walk over here okay y'all so now that i made it to rehearsal basically what my director was doing was showing me the blocking of the play and blocking means where i would be stationed at where i would be walking you know on set as i am acting and he's just showing me <laughs> And we usually rehearse in the auditorium on a stage, but there was a fashion show taking place today. So we did have to rehearse in the P studio. You know, rehearsal lasted about an hour and 30 minutes. So it was really, it was really nice. And it was really, it was just refreshing. I love acting so much, y'all. And I'm sorry, I did have to mute it because my director did write this play himself from start to finish and just for copyright reasons. Okay, y'all, so I made it back to my room. From rehearsals and rehearsals went good y'all this is our first week you know doing rehearsals so everything's going fine it's about eight o'clock ish and i don't want to keep myself in my room like i really want to find something to do so that hot spot from earlier they still have it going on like they still playing music so i'm definitely going to get out and go there because usually i'll be tired and i just go to sleep i just stay in my room my little comfort zone watching movies and stuff and i'm gonna go out so we outside honey <laughs> my problem is i still think that i'm in miami that's my mentality like i want to be outside but anyway i'm gonna see what this hot spot looking like okay <laughs>
Okay, y'all, so I made it back from the high spot. It's like 12, like 12, something at night. I had got completely sidetracked, but I've been in my room just chilling since then. And I'm going to go to sleep, y'all. Like, <laughs> it's been a whole day. Y'all spent the day with me. I hope that y'all enjoyed this video. I will see y'all next time. Thank y'all so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> see y'all next time.